คมาต่ออีพิโลกกันต่อคือมันไม่มีเควสขาวๆให้ให้ทำมาแล้วเป็นนี้เควสเดียวจริงต้องมีเอเมจิคเชียนตรงนี้ด้วยแต่มันหายไปซะแล้วไปลินลงก่อนอุ้โอ้โอ้โอ้มิสเตอร์ขอบคุณครับท่านโอ้ยคุณมีเวลาครับผมไม่รู้ว่าจะโอเคไหมขอบคุณมากครับสวัสดีครมิสเตอร์เกดิสเฮ้ยฉันเห็นว่ามีอีกครั้งหนึ่งกับพวกลาริมิบอยส์ใช่ไหมมีอีกครั้งหนึ่งฉันหมายความว่าคุณกลัวไหมคุณกลัวนิดหนึ่งฉันมีเงินเยอะมากในที่นี้ไม่ใช่แค่แห่งแล้วก็แห่งของแม่ของฉันมันมันยากที่จะอธิบายได้ฉันรู้ฉันจะทำให้คุณปลอดภัยครับคุณฉันรู้ว่าคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นแล้วคุณจะดีขึ้นอ no, 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 ันนี้ใครต้องการอีกไหมไม่ไม่ขอบคุณไม่ขอบคุณฉันชอบมิสเตอร์เพียร์สันจอห์นมาร์สตันคุณเป็นคนที่น่ารักโอเคเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ่มเย็นเริ
I... What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah! Yeah! Be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah. There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn. I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough! Something about my wife. Piss stinking, oh. shit shoveling, backwoods, oh. sacker, no oh. good, trash. That woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she. <laughs>
Good girl. Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, <laughs> that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. Will do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Hey, Mr. Jim? Mr. Jim? Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there, in, near the house. There is? OK. Thanks, Abe. What do you think you want? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. That's him. I see him. Thanks, Abe. Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. There most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Abigail. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail.
Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? Or hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting, unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done, unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. That's her fool. Hey, you know, I was wrong about you. you. Turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. Means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Hey, son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Is your father in? Can I have a word? Sure. I'll just get him. Pa! I'm right, right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? I'm sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. 
Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. But take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. I'm just joking, son. Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant cousin. Here's my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. <laughs> You'll get her back.
dusty trail Saw a vapor light Was it a mirage? I don't know, but it seemed right I felt mission, I felt trust I knew then that I must Just go to her from this cruel world เช็คก่อนกลัวเดี๋ยวทำเควสแล้วไม่นั่นดูเหมือนจะไม่แค่งั้นก็ทำแบบนี้ก่อนเมืองที่ไม่เคยมาเมืองดั้งเดิมของแก๊งเราเมื่อกี้เราผ่านเมื่อกี้เราผ่าน Apple c o s e e d ซึ่งเหมือนกระสร้างไม่เสร็จ
Maybe, girl. Partner. Who's this then? That's better, girl. You're fine, lady. Hello, sir. How are you? Excuse me, sir. Hey, uh, officer. Can I help you? Hello. Yeah. Welcome. Welcome. I'm looking for Mr. Atherton. I'm a friend of Mr. Getty's over at Pronghorn Ranch. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Mr. Atherton is in his office. Hey, please head in. Thank you. Yeah. Can I help you? I hope so. <clears throat> I want a loan, sir. A line of credit, so I can buy some property. What property? An old ranch, Beecher's Hope. <laughs> that old dump? I, I know it ain't much, but I ain't much of a farmer either. But I will get there. That is a very unusual way of asking for a loan. Mr. M Marston. Marston. Only folk around here call me Milton. It's kind of a joke, I guess. <laughs> a joke, huh? And which folk? Mr. Geddes. Uh -huh. I work for him. He said that you could help me out. I mean, if you can. So old David Geddes told you I'm the kind of man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a run-down farm on account of his lack of farming skills, huh? <laughs> Don't sound too promising when you put it like that. <laughs> well, how would you put it? Sorry to waste your time, sir. Oh, sit down. I'm sure we can figure something out. Now, of course, we'll be expecting you to make regular payments, and given a lack of much evidence you got any means of repaying, the terms won't be too great. But if my cousin vouches for you, it'll be okay with the bank. Really? <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you. Now, of course, we'll be expecting our money back regular as clockwork until the debt's settled. Otherwise, the farm reverts to the bank, no matter how much you paid. I understand. Mm -hmm. Well, why don't you go check out the land while I fix the contracts and talk to Mr. Geddes. Oh, I heard there's squatters up there. We've been having so many problems recently, they'll need clearing on. Sure. Well, come back when you're done, and we'll fix up the paperwork. เมืองนี้มีทุกอย่างเลยวะไม่มีบาเบอร์อยากตัดผมกาวินกาวินยังไม่จบอีกอิสระ Gone long? Uh, yeah, a few years, a few bloody years. <laughs> I can't. Um, I can't remember what he looks like. <laughs> I'm looking for him, but I don't know who he is. I'm uh, sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too. <laughs> I've wasted my life. I wasted my life looking. I looked, but I never saw. I saw nothing. <laughs> Kevin. Good luck. That is something else. Oh, I am so worried. Oh, Gav. All right. Gav. Need some? Uh, Gav. Mister? Who the hell are you? Where are you? Hey. 
Hey, come on, move it. Calm down. That attitude gonna get you killed before long. This is really hard. Stop it! Interested in a good read? Take a paper, please. Thanks. Have a great hey. day. How you doing, friend? อ่านหนังสือพิมพ์ก่อนนะครับรถไฟเบิร์ขโมยได้ทำไมไฟสีก็ไฟด้วย
So block market crash. Ah, we here. Wait, why in the dang? ใช่แบบนี้หรือเปล่าวะไม่รู้เหมือนกันมีทุกอย่าง
ป้ายไปหาเซดีแอนเลอร์ก่อนอยากรู้เหมือนกันว่าชะตาของนางจะเป็นยังไงนี่มันไรเนี่ยโดนป้นมาอาชีพน่าสัตว์เหมาะกับเรามากกว่าเฮ้ยเมีแต่คนโดนโอ้โดนถลกหนังหัวด้วยปัญหาของตรงนี้แน่เลยเมาไปเลยก็ได้คิดว่ามันคงต้องมีให้ทำแหละไม่งั้นก็จะโหลดเซฟเอา
Okay, no down. So, who's in charge here? No one, mister. This is a free country. <laughs> now that I ain't so sure about. Listen, I'm buying this land. I'm afraid... I'm afraid you guys are gonna have to go somewhere else. <laughs> who's this? I ain't sure. Some fancy dang city boy says he owns this land. Or he's gonna. Owns it? That's what he says. Okay. And how come we live in here? I ain't sure. Look. Take some money. Go try and find somewhere else to stay. You for real, friend? Sure, take it. <clears throat> You're a real gentleman. Okay, boys. Let's go celebrate. <laughs> Thanks, mister. <laughs> It's you, the man with two names and no past. Come on in. How'd you make out? Well, let's just say there are no more squatters. Okay. Well, I got your paperwork ready. Now, you sure about buying this place? It's really run down, and the price isn't too great. I think it would mean a lot for my wife. At least mean I was listening to her. Okay. Well, sign here and here. Now we own you, Mr. Marston, and we own Mr. Milton, too, and we own your property. But you can buy your freedom each week. Eventually, you will be a homeowner. I understand. Congratulations. You are now a real American, indebted and owned by the bank. <laughs> I'm joking. They own me. They just own your property. Now, you can also use this line of credit for any home improvements you need to make, of course. I can? Sure. Be good, Mr. Marston. Welcome to home ownership. It's a beautiful thing. Let your wife know what to complain about. I'm <laughs> just joking. Well, it is you. Well, I never. I, I thought you was dead, boy. Dead. Uncle? The very same. Come here. <laughs> I saw you going into the bank, and by the looks of things, you ain't robbed it. I've gone straight. Oh, bull crap. No, for real. <laughs> well, I'm trying. All these years, you ain't changed a bit. Maybe a little bit. I thought you was dead. <laughs> not yet. Well, I got some things to take care no, of. No, not a problem. I'll come, too. <laughs> no, you don't have to. Oh, no, I'm real sick, John. Lumbago. It's a slow and painful death, my brother. Evidently. Oh, have a little pity, will you? Huh? Come on, then. All right. <laughs> hey. 
you gonna mount up or what? Follow me. Yep, so it goes. Where are we headed? West. West? Oh, God, I ain't you a man of few words. I can see we're headed west. You know, speaking in monosyllables don't make you seem interesting. It makes you seem stupid. I don't care how I seem. Well, now, where west are we headed, you damn grunting fool? This ranch I... A ranch I bought just now. Is that what you were doing in the bank? Spending all your money? Oh, I want a ranch in the armpit of West Elizabeth. Oh, my lord. <laughs> Not that that's any of your concern, but... I was in the bank borrowing the money. Well, that's even worse. Yeah, you can run from a bounty, John. You can't run from a bank. Is Abigail there? No. She's, uh... Her and Jack are waiting until I'm set up before joining me out here. <laughs> you mean she left you? Oh, I never thought she was a smart woman, but, you know, this makes me think maybe I was wrong. <laughs> no more of that. I just bought this place, and you're lucky I'm showing it to you and not looking for a place to bury you out here. Good girl. Look at her. Okay. What do you think? Why exactly did you buy this dump? For Abigail? Why? Is she an idiot? No. What were you thinking? I don't know. She said she wanted it. She ever seen it? What are we gonna farm here? <laughs> Rocks? We? You don't have a hope here without a wise hand at the tiller. Enough of that. Get out of here. On your way. No, you're stuck with me. Seems I'm stuck with you. John, the rock farmer. <laughs> so, you think I'm an idiot? No. I know you're an idiot. เก้มาถึงพาร์ทสองซะแล้ว
อะอังเคิลคุยก่อนโดนด่าเลยเกตบ้านยังไงล่ะเนี่ยทำหนุมศพใครพังก็ไม่รู้ผมขอโทษนึกว่าหนุมศพเพื่อนเราอะไรไม่รู้น่าจะขายเทเชอร์แมปโอเคมิสซี
เกือบชนโก้โก้โก้โก้โก้โได้บอกว่าน่าได้นี่ก็ไม่ได้ยากนะเงินน้อยต้องหาเงินไม่มีพวกโจรข้างทางให้เรายิงด้วยตอนนี้ไปขายให้หมดว่ายน้ำอ่ะทำน้ำอำน้ำเก็บพวกเพื่อนนี้ให้หมดพื้นที่ที่คุ้นเคยเบิร์นทะเบียนไปไหมเนาะ
เลยถึงแล้วโอเคปิดไม้แป๊บไอ้บ้านหลังนั้นสร้างเสร็จแล้วI didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> We didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed feller up by Roanoke. Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She? She's fine. <laughs> She was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy some property, Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly, and some other stuff, good and bad. Hey, you any interest in bounties? No, uh, I've gone straight, huh? sort of. Oh. oh, it's legal, and usually. Then, maybe. Come on then. What? Where are we headed? Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. Come on, we got a bit of a ride. I know. Ah! Your telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. You're There's something else. What? Micah. Micah? I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Yeah, we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I got Uncle with me. We'll be okay. Uncle? Getting scalped by that gang out there might be preferable than living with him. Sometimes I think the same. Friend, how can I help? Oh, all right, see what you can find. 
Like I said, feller's name is Nathan Kirk. Banker. Bald. 45. Okay. You head up that way. I'll meet you in a bit. Say, I mean to meet my friend in town, but I don't know where he's staying. Bald New Yorker? Nathan Kirk? You know where he is? Afraid I don't know. Excuse me, friend. I'm looking for a Nathan Kirk, fellow from New York. Got any mail for him? Kirk? Kirk? No, not so as I would remember. Curly, I think. Oh, she's a woman. <laughs> Ask in the Welcome Center. Most tourists check in there. Okay, thank you. What now? You head in there and try to flush him out. I'll go get the horses and then wait here. And grab him if he tries running. Easy enough. You, uh, you seen a fella? Fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. Mr. Kirk! Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. Just a friend. Come on, open the door. I didn't do it. I didn't do it! Open the goddamn door! <laughs> Stop! Hey! That's Nathan Kirk! Oh! Got him? Oh, shut up! Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My wife, my wife is a, is a desperate woman. Are you, are you married, sir? None of your business what I am. She made me do it. She broke me. I did bad, but I'm not bad. There is a difference. Innocent until proven otherwise. 
Let's Where? Go. Shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Send it on my behalf to West Elizabeth Cooperative Bank in Blackwater. Pay down my loans. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. ชาเลนนี่จริงคือต้องไปหาเซดีก่อนแล้วเซดีก็จะได้ไปอยู่ตรงนั้นใกล้ละก็ได้ฟีโลมละแล้วก็เดี๋ยวคงมีล้างแค้นอีกฝนตกนี่นาแปดสิบหกนาทีแล้วได้เควนมั้งโอเคหมดของใหม่ต่อเก็บเรื่องงานโอเคเ
ลองดูไปแล้วอ่ะมึงไม่คุณน่าสงสารจังเลยเ
Né? Calma. Vai, galera. Tem lá? Que? Fui nele não, hein? Ain't you fine? Working hard? <coughs> It's the lumbago. I am. I overdo it. I, I'll get a relapse. It's very serious. Get up or get out. Oh, you can be so testy. What is it? Constipation? Guess you're my proof I'll never quite outrun my sins. You got so sanctimonious in your old age. No wonder she left you. It's like rooming with the King James Bible. <laughs> get up! Ow! I, I, I'm getting up. Oh, no, wait. What did I have to tell you? I, I went into town and... Oh, I got, I got a little drunk. Uh, oh, shit! Well, we gotta go. We gotta go to San Denis. Charles. Uh, Charles Smith is alive, I reckon. Charles Smith alive? Really? I, I reckon. Unless I dreamed it all, and by the sound of it, not doing too good neither. Come on, let's get off. All right. Yeah. <sighs> Back in San Denis. I never liked this place. Oh, yeah. Well, me neither. <sighs> All right. Let's go find that big sour bastard. Sure. <sighs> let's split up. Good idea. I'll take the saloons. You take the slum. Now, nah, how about I take the saloons and you take the slums? Let's go, girl. Hang in there, girl. Hey, lady. How you doing? You, mister. Hey, partner. Buddy. Sir. Good evening to you. Seen a big Indian guy? Indian? <laughs> sure. I've seen hundreds. A big guy. A boxer, maybe? Likes fighting? Yeah, yeah. Bare knuckle guy. Think he's he's fighting tonight over at St. Saturnine's. Thank you. Thanks a lot. No problem, bud. Hi, right, fellas. Not there. Hello, mister. Beginning to enjoy some peace and quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Ask that first bar man I met. He told me Charles was here. <laughs> Not one of life's great surprise. mysteries, it turns out. <laughs> massacre. And you are a killer. 
We both know what you gotta do. I'm leaving now. He don't know the half of it. John? You're... You're... I'm alive. <laughs> so are you. <sighs> So's he. That's Uncle? What are you doing? I don't know. I'm alive. Uncle thought maybe he was in some sort of trouble. Uh, kind of. Just... I don't know. I... I'm throwing fights for a few dollars. Throwing fights? Sure. And you like that? Of course not. So... So... Let me go place a bet. Come on. Man, I thought you were dead. Sure. Abigail's still alive, too, only she left me. Uh, excuse me. I'd like to place a bet. On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? All of this. Okay. Funny thing, I pegged you for the favorite, but the odds just got real good. What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Real redskin brave. Ladies sure, I'm a fan of the wolf. Give me a bet on him. Have I got a treat for you? An epic battle between the descendant of ancient warriors and a not-so-noble savage. On my left. A ferocious battle from the valleys, Simon of Wales. And on my right, an Indian Hercules. The savage, the untamable, the unbeaten, and dare I say unbeatable, Lone Wolf. You know how this works. No weapons, no forfeiting, no crying like a beaten child. Everything else goes. You win by knockout, you win by retirement, or you win by death. Let's have a good fight, boys. Let's keep it clean, but not so clean. Look at him, Charles. Bonsai, bonsai. The wolf. What is this? Try and stay on your feet, you hear? Hit him. Knock him out. Hit him, Lone Wolf! No! Don't black out just yet! Pretend he's Micah! What's he doing? Knock him out! Try and stay on your feet, you hear? Hit him, Charles! What the hell? Don't black out just yet! <laughs> Come on, Lone Wolf. Better get you the hell out of here. Hey! Lone Wolf! Whoa! Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. <laughs> so it goes. Here's your share, partner. If we just made the bed, I said we So you keen on staying around here or heading off with me and Uncle? But, John, I haven't seen you two in years. I know. But right now, my sense is you just need to lie low. Where? We got a little place up past Blackwater in the high country. Okay. Well, I gotta grab my baggage. I booked a steamer heading up river. That's why I was pretending to throw the fight. Okay, boys. I'll meet you at the bridge outside San Denis. What are you doing? Uh, I just have a few urns of room. <laughs> You're useless. I am a deep thinker. Be quick. Come on. This way. Uh, my bag's on the dockside. So, what happened? You mean back then? Uh, Arthur helped me get out. Gave me a chance to live, I guess. You, you know that Arthur... Sure. Will got to me up north, so I went back and buried him in Miss Grimshaw. I had to run. If any of us had been found, we'd have... Oh, of course. I understand. He's where he would have wanted to be. A pretty hillside, facing the evening sun. He gave me his satchel with some of his things in it. Remember that journal? He always drew in. I got it. I'm a bit of a draftsman myself nowadays. He was a good man. As much as any of us could be. Getting sick like that has to rattle a fella. Uh, rattle him or I'll give him some kind of understanding what his life was really all about. Yeah. That makes sense. Anyway. I heard all of you were dead. Or I might have come looking. And me, the same about you. Dutch? Who knows? 
Dead? Maybe? I'm not sure. I heard all kind of things, but one thing I know, he ain't around here. I ain't heard nothing real in years since, well, that time. Nor me. Micah. I hope that bastard's dead. You know, he was the one speaking to them agents. What? Putting them on us the whole time. Or since before I got off Sisica. They picked up Strauss. The agents. Made a real mess of him. I heard he died in custody. Never said a word. <sighs> Guess some folk is strong in ways you can't see. Everything that happened. All those deaths. Micah? None of us is innocent in that. Dutch, least of all. But I don't think we would have had to make those calls. All that mayhem. If it wasn't for... We were on a very bad path. Okay. Uh, hold on. What? Careful. Why? Those are Guido Martelli's men. Who? He... Uh... He used to work for Angelo Bronte. I've only been here an hour. Hey. Uh, Come over here. What now? Well, you go left, I go right. On three. Mm -hmm. Three. <laughs> chance we have of denying it at least no we can't get caught martelli has the police ah! chief in his pocket if they take us in we won't get out of the interview room i don't want to get a shootout ah! over this that's not the man i try to be anymore no i don't want that either you see anything <sighs> i think we're clear if i ever want to go back remind me that I hate Saint Denis. Guido Martelli will happily remind you of that. Give me some simple folk and wide open spaces. Speaking of simple. John Charles! <laughs> you boys been all getting up to no good? Kind of. Been getting shot at. Well, they weren't very good shots. Come on, let's head for home. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Yeah, off by and then die, nah. Off by upload gun.
อะสัญญาณรู้เรื่องคุยกับสองคนนี้ก่อนก็ได้Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? There's a fellow by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay, you keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's going to tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. รอบสุดท้ายโอเคพอแค่นี้ก่อนน่าจะไปขำขันได้แล้ว